gonna be dogs now, innit? Surely? Yeah, here we go. Fetch me there, you penis! No, 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 not penis. Please, for the love of God. This isn't Outlast, man. Okay, Deadshot doesn't work on the dogs, I don't think. Kind of wish I didn't buy Deadshot, I prefer just aiming in my line of fire. Because now I can't shoot them in the leg for points. I have to shoot them in the face. Why, thank you, sir. We needed a max ammo anyway, which is pretty beast. Don't know what he was doing, he was like, I like this place, bloody mouths, me and the Susan are going to come live here. Me and the Susan. Me and the Susie. Holy bloody Jemima, you bloody piffler. Ow, dick holes. Put down that teddy bear. You dirty, you bastard. They're spawning underground. Don't spawn underground, it makes my job very irritating. That was a lot of dogs, wasn't it, Pat? Easy, easy, easy on the goods, you fucking... No fish fingers for you tonight, you dirty little bastard. Throw the grenade... Oh, oh my god. Just throw the grenade without getting script errors, mate. There you go. Come on. Oh, that got three kills. Right, I think that's the majority. Right now, the minority, who are just complete assholes, are going to be a mixture of down here. Alright, let me just, before I go. Right. Now, they are going to be little fuckers, and they are going to be. <laughs> that didn't scare me. Oh, oh, fuck, oh, 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 trick shot, mate. Mate, that was a YY switch trick shot. Don't fuck me about it. Night bullets and that. Oh, baby. Baby, baby. Touch my air show. A hundred in this, what am I talking about? Oh, yeah. Can't get yourself soon. His gun is uh, four shot now. Still, not exactly bad, is it now? So, challenges on this map in particular to come. We've got a challenge by Dan. Dan wants us to do a uh, the, gu the gun on the van in the first spawn. He wants us to buy that, see how long we can last with it. Obviously, we can use our pistols, our nades, buy as many perks as we want, etc. Uh, but we have to buy the gun on the van. Uh, then obviously we've got to do a no perks, uh, we've got a uh, pistols only challenge, we've got, what else have we got, blimey, we've got the MLG challenge where we have to jump around 360 every time we want to kill zombies, that's going to be a bit of a bitch, um, we've got, what else have we got, blimey, we've got, I um, think that's pretty much all of them, there are a couple I'm missing out, because I just can't remember them, because I'm being an idiot. Um, and plus any we get from the time that I actually record this to the time where it actually goes live, so you've got to also remember that. Throw a nate. Don't get script errors with me, you little fuck. Throw it. Good boy. We are getting some mad kills with those nades. Because they're enhanced by the fucking napalm zombies. Damn right, bitch. We might also be doing a couple of these challenges caught. So I might get a couple of the pals along. We might do a couple of these with a, an extra person, you know? I might try a different map. Obviously, that casino map is super difficult. So I'm wondering if we have more than one person while we're doing it. Obviously, we'd both have to abide by the rules. Um, but yeah. So we can do that, which would be pretty cool. Oh, I hate this thing when it fucking locks onto heads and you can't quite see if it's actually locked on properly. Whoa, I hate it when it does that, man. I might hip fire it a bit more. Fuck it, I'm gonna risk my life for that. Reverse the train! The 
mad lag you get when you're shooting these napalm zombies is fucking unreal. So we literally only have points now to spend on packer punching again for ammo. Um, and that is it. <laughs> and other doors if we fancy venturing somewhere new. I might buy the Bowie knife just in case of a clutch situation. It might. Nah, I wouldn't fucking do shit, would it? I'm wondering if that. I don't think those explosions actually affect other zombies, which is a bit annoying. You get 100 points for a headshot, so that's actually not a bad thing. It's quite a cheap perk as well, so it's something you could really roast some challenges for. Roast some challenges for. Roast some points for. For early game stuff, so that's pretty good. So this, uh, again, is by Brobro, Bro, the first box challenge. We got extremely lucky with this gun. This gun is tasty, man. Now what I might do in a minute guys is I might actually turn because it looks like we're going to be surviving for a while and obviously you guys can see that we're getting a little bit of lag from Gmod just because of all the blood, all the bullets and just everything's getting a bit mental. So I might actually uh, do some things in the settings so if the game looks a bit weird in a minute, that's why. So uh, better it look a little off than uh, us lagging out because I don't want to crash. Because I want you guys to see the uh, extent of this thing. Now we're about to run out of ammo on this thing. Don't really need carpenter, so I'm not going to risk my life for that. Might as well get it now that we're here. How much actually is this? I'm curious to know. It is 5,000. Holy cow. I thought it said 500 when I first read it. It doesn't say 500 at all. So this is still a four shot in the head. Blimey. Can't believe we can't buy this. The only thing I can buy to get rid of... Fucking hell. What perks we have? Buy new ones. I think if we were to go down instead of getting quick revive again... Just to boost up the pressure a bit more. That we don't have that extra full. Although we would lose every perk we have. So that's a bit of a risk. But I might actually just buy something else. I might buy a new set of perks. Obviously Juggernaut. No dispute on that. But I'd probably buy, you know. Uh, what's this? Is this Mule Kick? Double Tap. Stamina. Juggernaut. Uh, and maybe this thing again. I don't know what the fuck it does though. Okay, we know where the. Ow, we know where these guys are. Bloody ticks. Hello, laddies, how are you today? Jumping around like absolute nutters, aren't you? Make way for the Buddhas. That it? No, that's not it. Just Harry. Harry, you little fucker. Harry? Huh? <gasps> it's not Harry. Who the fuck is it? We're gonna have to make up a new name. Fucking Neil and Harry, you little bastards. I can hear you. Oh shit. What? Who else? Who else can we name and shame? Fucking Philip, you bastard. Philip, Neil and Harry. The three troublemakers. Alright guys, welcome back. So I have changed all the textures up. We've lowered everything ever so slightly. So hopefully it doesn't look too much different to me from what I'm looking at now. It doesn't look very different, just a bit more grey. Um, but it should just basically save us a little bit of lag. Um, we shouldn't lag like this for now, obviously, but when we've got those mad trains behind us and the zombies exploding and shit like that, 
I just prefer you guys to see a smoother experience. So that's what we're doing. Holy fucking dick sucks. That zombie was keen. So the zombies in the next couple of rounds are really going to start being pretty mental. So uh, this is where zombies really kicks off. I've got no idea quite how long we're going to last. I don't really know. I mean, it's looking pretty good at fucking hell. It's looking pretty good at the moment. But uh, obviously, all can change with a bad move. And that's basically what we got to not do. I don't know what the fuck those Gandhis were doing, but they didn't decide to hit me, so we're all good. Another mad nade to try and sort out the Gandhis. We killed two of them. That's what I'm talking about. We get hooked on that box and we get caught out. It's not going to be good. Oh, mate, this is mental. Cool. That was pretty clutch. That's where uh, the headshot perk really just comes insane. Just when you're in those sort of situations where it's just amazing. Oh, God, this is tense now, guys. We haven't got napalm zombies this round. So I wonder if they're every sort of five rounds or so. I don't know. We have got a max ammo there, which is rather tasty. So we can be as spray as we want on these next couple of couple of runs. Right, let's go get it before it runs out, just in case we miss it, and that is not what we want. Kapoosh, kapoosh. Now, hopefully, we'll, be, we'll uh, be seeing a lot of those. Oh, fucking hell. You gotta love when you try and throw a nade and you just get script errors instead. Because that's a worthy trade out. Oh, that was a good one. Now, hopefully, this works. Nice. Oh, very nice. So, I don't know how often the napalm zombies are. I don't really know much about them. Oh, I'm just enjoying the grenades, mate. Mad grenade trick shot montage! Oh, it killed a few things. Did you see that? Damn. So 10,000 points. I thought I said 100,000 then. I thought we'd reach a milestone. I'm basically just sort of getting them together. That's what the whole kind of grenade thing is. Just kind of getting them together, to be honest. Just to do this. Ah, little girl of me. See that little sneaky montage there? Well, oh, these zombies are really running now, aren't they? Capoach, capoach, 11,000. Headshot, Biarchai! I'm not looking forward to the next set of dogs. They're going to be a lot of them and they're going to be very strong. Well, hopefully, we have the ammo to deal with them. Um, we're always pretty much going to have enough points for ammo now, I'm hoping, he says. You know, it's not like we're struggling for points. That's the good thing. I think we're going to use the pistol for a bit. Pistol's our backup gun, but, you know. Might as well have a bit of fun with it. Prefer hip-firing guns, to be honest. It just feels better to fucking hip-fire them. That's probably what wrecks our train, actually. You see how they all got stuck just now on that post over there? I'm wondering if that's what kind of makes them all split up. Because if you notice... Oh. If you notice how every time we run through here, there's always the odd couple that run through the middle. I wonder if that's what it is. Right, we're going to stop using our backup gun now that it's only got six mags left. Cheeky little minx. This gun's good. There's not many guns I'd prefer to get than this one. I'd, I'd have loved to get that fucking M60 thing. That thing would have been beast. Cool, how long have we been playing now? Like an hour? This is good. 
I think the best one so far, isn't it? 14? We finished on round 13 just because we wanted to finish uh, in the preview of this uh, of the game mode. And then on the pistols challenge, we, uh, pistols and shotgun challenge, we died very early because we're very shit. Uh, and then on, um, on the, um, first challenge we did, which was the box roulette challenge, we got to 13, and then I made a very bad mistake. So this is actually the furthest we've ever gone. We've hit that milestone, guys, furthest we've ever been. can't remember what the furthest I ever got. I used to be a console player, Xbox. So, uh, I was playing with my friends, mainly Harry, uh, back in our 13 years of, uh, our, uh, 13s, sorry. Back then, this was literally what we lived on. <laughs> Just zombies. I can't remember what round we got to. We did really well once, I seem to remember. Damn it. Um, and, uh, I think we got to, like, round 50 or something. It was a very high round. I can't remember what it was. If you're watching now, Harry, put it in the comments. What, what do you remember? What round was it, bro? I'm trying to remember, but it's... Can I seriously do this? Ha. <laughs> It'd be quite amusing, wouldn't it? Probably gonna have a flood of the bastards come down these stairs now. Oh no, we're alright. Alright, let's go get other zombie Harry. Shoot the shit out of him. Oh, okay, so Harry was the last one. You cheeky bastard. Oh, God, we're low on, low on ammo. Come on, quick, quick, quick. Move that ass. 